Hello goddesses and welcome to another Bucket List Series video. Today we are in San Francisco. I'm going to take you guys with me and let's just get right into it. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, so you know we have to start with the outfit of the day. Originally, I was gonna wear this dress, but it is way too cold in San Francisco, so I had to be a lot more practical, and I put on some yoga pants, a really cute top, same color as the dress, a nice little knitted sweater, and my favorite pair of shoes. I had to stop at Starbucks and get me a little souvenir cup. I'm doing that every single place that I go, but we are on our way to one of, I think, the most talked about things in San Francisco, the Golden Gate Bridge. I feel like every time you see this, you know exactly where they're filming or where somebody's at. It's literally iconic and the videos and pictures never do anything justice. That's my personal opinion. It's so much more beautiful in person and it's almost like crazy to see something so amazing. Like I've never seen the Statue of Liberty, but I feel like it would be the same concept where it's like, how did they make this? <laughs> like how many hours did it take for somebody to achieve this? Like it just blows my mind. It's so amazing. And there's so much like rich history, like right by the Golden Gate Bridge. There's also a, um, Alcatraz, I believe is how you pronounce it, but it is like one of the like most notorious prisons that's like in the middle of the ocean that's right here, the middle of the lake that's right here. And I have a little bit of video footage on it, but not a whole lot because the tours are still not open fully for Alcatraz. So um, maybe when they open up, I'll head back to San Francisco and do a tour for you guys. I don't know, maybe I'll be brave enough to do that. But look at how stunning this bridge is. It always reminds me of Full House and we could not find the house of Full House because we were in San Fran for one day. And the traffic here is like ridiculous. Like it doesn't look too bad right now because it's really early in the day. But the later the day goes on, like it took us an hour to move 30 miles, not even 30 miles, like 20 miles. Like it was ridiculous. Um, so yeah. <laughs> but honestly, if you can get past the traffic, it is a beautiful place to visit. This is like right next to the Golden Gate Bridge. And if you see like a little island in the middle right there, actually, um, that is Alcatraz. That's where like they had like Al Capone and a bunch of like the most notorious criminals in the world were like living there for a few years, you know? So it's kind of crazy to me. It used to be a military base. A lot of places that I've gone this trip actually used to be military bases and then it just got converted into other things. But now you can see again, the beautiful Golden Gate Bridge and all of its glory. There are actually quite a few bridges here in San Francisco, which I have a bunch of footage I'll show you guys, but right now is my photo shoot opportunity. And um, it's so funny because whenever you do photo shoots in public, you do run into like other people being in the shot on accident. So normally what I do in this situation is I'll just like check my phone, reply back to any comments, reply back to any messages until it is time to reshoot, which we are doing here. I wanted to get as many cool videos and pictures right in front of this bridge because honestly, I don't know when I will be back in San Francisco. Hopefully it won't take me too long to head back, but I wanted to really make the most of this beautiful, beautiful background and the scenery right here absolutely so much more stunning in person don't mind that little like sign in the back i try to cover it with my body but yeah you guys cannot tell by this video footage but there are so many people here all around it's just i got like as close to the edge as possible but there were like uh, tons of people i was gonna say hundreds maybe hundreds a lot of people and i heard it gets like even more packed the later in the weekend this was a thursday no that this was a friday i believe this is a friday and um it gets even more packed i guess on saturdays and sundays but how beautiful i would love to live here and walk the golden gate bridge every single day because let me tell you it is a workout <laughs> we made it like halfway and then we decided to go back because one not only is the wind working against you so like if you were a bike rider which they have a ton of bike riders here you're gonna have to like kind of like make your body work harder to go against the wind and all of that stuff. Um, or you could just be like me and just do cartwheels because you know, that's what I do. <laughs> it's like my signature move. Um, but yeah, no, it's definitely an intense workout. And then 
on top of it, you have all this beautiful, beautiful scenery. Look at that. I feel like you can even like run across the bottom of the bridge if you really wanted to. Um, but it's just breathtaking in person, honestly. I'm gonna get you guys another good shot of like Alcatraz and everything else. Alcatraz is like right there in the middle again. Um, and there's like people who are constantly boat riding. Uh, when I was doing those cartwheels, by the way, I was getting so many honks. I don't know if people were like mad or upset or they wanted to be a part of the video. I don't know, but it was pretty funny. Um, I think the longer I've been doing YouTube, the less embarrassed I've been getting, <laughs> for sure. After all of that excitement, we decided to go into Oakland, which I've never been to, and um, it's very different than San Francisco, I have to say. It's a whole different vibe, but they have some of the best tacos, and we decided to stop and check it out for ourselves. I highly recommend this place. It's so yummy, so delicious if you are in Oakland or by Oakland or in San Fran and you want to try something different. Now, this road right here, I don't know if you guys can tell from the way that the car is moving, but this is an iconic road to San Francisco. It is called Lumbar Street, and I actually had never heard of the street before looking into San Francisco. When uh, we decided that we wanted to go here, we were kind of like looking into things, and yeah, I when I saw it, I was like, definitely we have to go here. I wanted to ideally take a picture at the bottom so you guys could see it. I'll still link a picture here somewhere in the video right now so you guys can see what the road actually looks like. It's insane and iconic to San Francisco. But um, there was just like nowhere to park, honestly, because it was really crowded. This is definitely a touristy area. So parking was very sparse. So unfortunately, we did not take a photo shoot <laughs> in front of this crazy road. But maybe next time again, like I've said, maybe next time when we are in San Fran, because one day to explore a whole city is definitely not enough. But uh, we definitely did get a lot of things checked off our bucket list. So I'm very, very proud of that. After all of that, we um, headed around just to do a little bit more sightseeing. Uh, this is the Golden Bridge, oh, again, Golden State Bridge again, but I wanted to capture it and show you guys uh, later on in the day because the clouds overcast some of the bridge and it looks really, really cool. So I wanted to share that with you guys as well. But for the remainder of this video, I'm just gonna have you guys watch with me as I travel around San Francisco. You guys get to see all of the cool scenery and I'm just gonna let the beautiful music play in the background. So enjoy. If you guys haven't already, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Comment down below your favorite part of San Francisco. And yeah, I will be back with another video in the very near future because I am on a little mini road trip adventure and I will be sharing every little aspect of it as much as I can actually with you guys. So I love you until next time.